Today we are reading Never Tease a Weasel. Never tease a weasel. You can knit a kitten mittens, and perhaps that cat would purr. You could fit a fox with socks that exactly matched his fur. You could make a goat a coat with a collar trimmed in mink. Or give a pig a wig in a dainty shade of pink. <laughs> but never tease a weasel. This is very good advice. A weasel will not like it. And teasing isn't nice. You could make a riding habit for a rabbit if you choose. Or make a turkey perky with a pair of high-heeled shoes. You could make a collie jolly with a red crocheted cravat. Or make a possum blossom in an Easter Sunday hat. But never tease a weasel. Not even once or twice. A weasel will not like it and teasing isn't nice. You could build a mouse a house with a chimney made of bricks. You could give a dove some gloves and a set of walking sticks. But never tease a weasel! There! Now I've said it thrice. A weasel will not like it. And teasing isn't nice. You could give a mule a pool and some jaunty swimming trunks. <laughs> Send a case of Spanish lace to a pair of lady skunks. <laughs> to Miss Maudie and Miss Pew Pew. <laughs> oh. There we go. You could give a fish a dish for her favorite seaweed stew. Send three frogs some sailing togs. And a yachting cap or two. But never tease a weasel. Now I can't be more precise. Oh, a weasel will not like it, and teasing isn't nice. Oh, hold up. You could bake a Drake a cake for his special birthday treat. You could braid a bug a rug to make his bug house neat. You could feed a spider cider or perhaps pink lemonade, or give a moose some juice to sip on in the shade. But never tease a weasel! 
Now, remember what I've said. It's more fun to please a weasel and be friends with him instead. Aww. The end. I hope you liked this book. If you did, be sure to smash that like button. And I'll see you with another video very soon.